What's going on guys? I've got here a 2020 F-250 Super Duty and I'm gonna do a few things using this truck. I'll show you the location of the fuses and the relays for the upfitter switches. I'm also gonna show you how, where you can locate the wiring that is connected to the switches. And I'll also go into detail how you can program the switches behavior. Switches five and six, you can program to only work when the truck is on or you can program them to work when the truck is on or off. So I'll show you exactly how to do that. So to start with, we're gonna head under the hood. We're gonna step up here and first things first, I just wanna show you on page 553 of your owner's manual, this is where you can read the color coding for the aux switches. So it'll show you here on the left-hand side the switch number and then right in here, it'll show you the wire color. It also tells you the fuse amp rating of that switch. Switches one through four can put out a 25 amp power and fuses five through six, you can power up to 40 amps on that. Now for the fuses and relays for the upfitter switches, it's gonna be underneath this fuse box cover. Pull this tape down and push in here and allow this to pivot upward and out. Setting that aside, you can see here I've labeled the relay for you. And the fuses, we've got our larger 40 amp fuses for switch five and switch six. And one through four uses these 25 amp fuses. So we've got one, two, three, and four. This small fuse is for the run start relay. This one is for the PTO relay. And finally, we've got a fuse here that's Ford calls it customer access. That sends out a constant 20 volt power. Now you've, you'll note there's a very small five amp fuse here. That five amp fuse is actually the key in how you set up the switches uh, when they come on. So in the default position, you have the jumper pushed all the way to the left, like what we have here. What this does is it only allows the upfitter five and upfitter six switch to be on when the truck is on. If we pull this fuse out, set it aside we can then slide this piece over and then reinstall the fuse in this position the switch five and the switch six will work even when the truck is off even when the key is out of the ignition so that's how you program the behavior of five and six and you might even hear the relays uh, firing as i move this around now, as far as actually accessing the wires, real simple. We actually just look underneath the fuse box. So hanging down right here, it's kind of tucked in there right next to this AC line. I'm gonna grab this and pull it out. And you can unravel this tape and these wires will, they're kind of coiled up so they get longer. But yeah, this is where you'll find the, uh, the color coded wires that correspond to what I've shown you on uh, the owner's manual. So yeah, I hope that this information has been helpful for you. Or at the very least, a good starting point in troubleshooting the uh, upfitter switches on your Super Duty. Please let me know down below if you have any questions or more importantly, any advice. And thanks for watching.